Let's do a problem here where we cut a piece of cloth in two different ways but get the same area. Here is our problem. Shown below are two identical pieces of cloths in the shape of parallelogram. Both pieces of cloths are cut along two different diagonals. Let's check if the area of two pieces of cloths is equal or not. So we have two identical pieces of cloth in the shape of the parallelogram and these are cut along different diagonals. This one is cut along the yellow diagonal and this one is cut along the red diagonal. We have to check whether the area of these two pieces is equal or not. One important point to keep in mind here is Although these two parallelograms are identical and hence congruent, these two parts need not be congruent because these two parts are cut along different diagonals and diagonals need not be equal. So these two parts need not be congruent. Let's see how we can do this problem with the help of congruence. Both the pieces in the form of parallelogram are given to be identical in the question and when these are identical that means they are congruent and being congruent means areas of these two pieces of cloth is same. So area of parallelogram 1 is equal to area of parallelogram 2. So this is our parallelogram 1 and this is our parallelogram 2. So in the first parallelogram, if we call this region as region A and this region as region B, so we can see that these two regions are in the form of the triangles and these two triangles will be congruent by SSS. Why? Because this side is equal to this side opposite sides of the parallelogram for the same reason this side is equal to this side and the diagonal is common. So we can say that this triangle is congruent to this triangle by SSS condition of congruency and because these triangles are congruent so their areas will be same so we can say area of region A is equal to area of region B. So area of region A is equal to area of region B and after cutting we can see that this is region A. So area of region A will be half of area of parallelogram 1. This implies area of region A is equal to half area of parallelogram 1. Similarly, in the second parallelogram, we can call this triangle as region C and this triangle as region D. And this triangle here is region C. So as in the first case here, area of region C will be equal to half of area of parallelogram 2. So in these two equations, RHSs will be same as area parallelogram 1 is equal to area parallelogram 2. So their LHSs will also be same and we will have area of region A is equal to area of region C. That means these two pieces are equal in area. So area of region A is equal to area of region C. So we find that area of these two pieces of cloth obtained after cutting is equal. Let's summarize what we have learned from this problem. We've learned from this problem that a diagonal of a parallelogram divides the parallelogram into two congruent triangles and this we can prove making use of SSS criterion of congruency.